um, Richard Sleeman, a true pioneer in the field of organ transplantation, has passed away at the age of 62, just two months after making history as the first person to receive a kidney from a genetically modified pig. Sleeman's journey has come to an end. Uh, his story began in Massachusetts, where he underwent a groundbreaking procedure at Massachusetts General Hospital. The hospital's transplant team is deeply saddened by his death, stating that there is no indication that it was related to the recent transplant. Uh, Slayman, the supervisor for the State Transportation Department, had previously received a human kidney in 2018. Um, when it began to fail, any, any uh, developed congestive heart failure, his doctors suggested he try a kidney from a modified pig. He saw this as not only a way to help himself, but also to provide hope for the thousands of people in need of transplants. The surgery lasting four hours um, was a significant medical milestone. For years, researchers have been exploring xenotransplantation as a solution for uh, organ failure. Uh, the main challenge has been uh, the rejection of animal tissue by the human immune system. However, recent advancements in genetic engineering have allowed for um, the modification of animal organs to be more compatible with uh, human recipients. Um, the pig kidney transplanted into Slayman was engineered by eGenesis, a biotech company based in Cambridge, Massachusetts, and uh, by removing three genes and adding seven others, um, the, the kidney was made more compatible for transplantation. Um, eGenesis praised Slayman as a true pioneer whose courage has paved the way for future patients in need of organ transplants. Uh, his family also expressed comfort in knowing that his case has inspired so many others waiting for a chance at a new lease on life. As we mourn the loss of a medical trailblazer, we also celebrate his legacy and the impact he has had on the field of organ transplantation. Uh, Richard Slayman may be gone, but his story will continue to inspire hope and optimism for future patients in desperate need of life-saving transplants.